Hey, this is Digital by Computing. Let's look at how to remove applications or scripts or programs from automatically starting on your Mac on Mojave. Let's do that right now. So here we are logged into our Mac. All we need to do is we need to open up system preferences. So you've got system preferences by going into the Apple logo and system preferences. You can also go down into your dock and you've got the system preferences icon just down there. From within here, we go into the users and groups folder and then you'll have your current users listed. So myself, uh, I've got myself listed and you may have other users in here. So if you do want to remove these from other users, you need, you need to go one by one and do it manually from each individual user. So once I've selected the user that I want to check, I click on login items. And within here, you'll see that these items will open automatically when you log in. So if you don't want any of these programs from opening automatically, you select the program you don't want to be opening and remove, quite easy. So I don't want stickies, for example, opening and I can remove as well as calculator and I can remove. And that's essentially it. So they're gonna be programs that are starting automatically uh, from within the login items on your Mac. The other area that you may wanna look at is in your dock down the bottom, you may have certain applications that start up automatically that aren't listed in that login item section. So for example, I know that image capture is opening when I start up my Mac. So I can right click on it and go into options and you'll see that open that login is ticked. So I literally just untick that. And the same deal with system preferences that I know is doing the same thing, options and untick that. So now if I go back into system preferences, you'll see that open at login is no longer ticked. So that is the simple ways on how to stop programs and applications from starting up automatically on your Mac. Love it if you commented and like my video as well. We'll see you next time. So if you found that video helpful, please like it and subscribe to my channel Digital by Computing just on the button there for more videos.